Om Shanti. Welcome to 3rd of December's Godly Blessing. Supreme Father is talking about something which is very pure in our culture. That is Suhag. So Suhag means being wed. So here God Father says, May you have a right to the tilak of a future kingdom. You see, whenever we, whenever we used to get coronated in the ancient Bharat, then there used to be a Raj tilak which was given and a crown which was given. So here too, Godfather says, may you have a right to the tilak of a future kingdom, in the future, that is Satya Yuga, there will be a kingdom over there, by having the tilak of imperishable suhag, being wed and fortune. Both the things. At the confluence age, you receive the tilak of the suhag, of the deity of all deities, and of the fortune of being a child of the supreme soul. So we're getting the tilak of the suhag of the deity of all deities. That means Devon Kitev. That means someone who's even above the deities, who's the creator of deities. So we're getting a tilak from him. That means soul conscious knowledge. And also the fortune of being a child of the supreme soul. Paramatma. God. If the tilak of suhag and fortune is imperishable, Maya cannot erase it. That means if we are constantly soul conscious and also, we consider ourselves to be a child of God, then Maya cannot erase it. Therefore, someone who wears the tilak of Suhag and fortune here claims a right to the tilak of the future kingdom. Sorry, There is the festival of the royal tilak in every birth. In every birth, when the governments were not there, a couple of hundreds of years ago, when there was kingdoms in India or Bharat, there used to be festivities whenever a new prince would become a king and the prince was given a tilak and also a crown on his head along with the king celebrating the day for receiving a tilak the royal family also celebrates this day of receiving the tilak that means even the royal family should become someone who has a suhag that means who is constantly soul conscious and god conscious and also someone who consider themselves as a child of supreme soul so we ourselves have to become that and we have to help others to become that the royal family and that is what we learn in the brahma kumaris om shanti with this